In today's video, we're going to discuss why the nav erosion experienced in our yield max funds doesn't affect my fire lifestyle, which is financially independent, retire early. So we earn over 150,000 in dividends per year at this channel, and you can too. Email me for my e-guides at akintod48 at gmail.com if you're interested in living the fire lifestyle as well out of your brokerage account. So here at this channel, if you don't already know, for every $1 you put in your account, you get $4 of purchasing power. So this is why anyone can do this. I also use margin, okay? I'm gonna show you that in one second. But you can see by my performance here that I'm up 22% uh, for the year. The SP is up 18%. So we're beating the S&P and we were up, I keep saying this in every video, we were up 50% for the year, as you can see below. Okay, we're up almost, well, you can see we're up 50%. I've showed you in my past videos. And um, and so we had a fall in October, and that's because of uh, you know the month of October. A, a lot of funds fell, not just Cornerstone. Even though there is nav erosion happening in many of my funds, it uh, doesn't seem to be affecting my performance. I used some margin, okay, 154000 in debt. So theoretically, in one year, my dividends of 154000 should pay this debt back. Now I could choose to add more debt or you know reinvest my share, so that's up to me. But um, it's low interest debt. I negotiated my interest down to uh, around six percent. I used to have it at three uh, percent. Many of my clients have done the same who bought my e guides. When you buy my e guides, you get my phone number to call me anytime you need me. So this is where I help you uh, negotiate um, your rates down or um, maximize the performance in your portfolio. So yield max fund, erosion, okay? Why I don't care about that. Tesla, okay, I just did a video on Tesla, if you want to see that. And it has around a 60% dividend. So obviously, in two years, it cash flows. In less than two years, it should cash flow, uh, meaning it should double. So I don't care what happens to the stock price. I mean, at an 80% at an dividend, that would be, you know, less than a year or a little over a year at cash flows. It doubles for you. So everything after is house money. And this is important because even if the stock goes down during that time frame, you're qualifying for income to banks. Okay, this is the key to the FIRE lifestyle is to use your dividends to keep showing them your income. Okay, and yes, after a year or two, it doubles. So now your share price, your, 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 you've been completely paid back. Everything after is completely uh, icing on the cake. And uh, then you say, here's what the next argument is that people bring up. It's, yes, but will it, will it erode the, the stock price into the ground? MSFO. Now, this, if you look at a chart of this yield max stock, you'll see that it's doing great. Yes, um, Microsoft is doing great. As you can see, it's up on its chart, okay? There it is, it's up. So the nav erosion isn't too big of a factor in something like Microsoft. Also, Microsoft, last time I checked Microsoft, it was 30% maintenance. And this is also the key to living the fire lifestyle is low maintenance. I just wanted to point this out. View margin maintenance requirement, 30%. So it's one of the only yield max funds that has low maintenance. If you need more help understanding maintenance, that's in my volume three margin e-guide, okay? Um, the 30% maintenance on Microsoft is huge. And so I want to add to Microsoft, after all, it's such a large part of the indexes, um, but I'm waiting for a pullback, okay? And also the dividend isn't as high, but it's still really nice, as you can see there, and the stock price is going up. So not all these funds erode, okay? Even my favorite fund, Cornerstone. Yes, it erodes on its chart, okay? Uh, as you can see here, Cornerstone, this is what I have a volume four e-guide on. Uh, Cornerstone's a five-star fund, just so you know. Here it is, five-star fund, Cornerstone. Okay, so uh, you may be new at this channel, and we're talking about nav erosion and yield max. But look, Cornerstone is, is known for its erosion. You look at a chart of Cornerstone, but look at it here on Morningstar. You see that it has an upward trend when you factor back in the dividends and drips. Okay, so Cornerstone, here it is on the chart. We've gone completely sideways here on a 10-year chart, but on Morningstar, uh, you know, we had an upward left to right move. Okay, so got to factor in, f factor in dividends and drips. You have to learn how to play this fund properly. You have to time it around its rights offering, which is what my uh, Volume 4 e-guide is all about. And uh, you also have to turn on that special drip. It drips its dividend, the 21% dividend at the NAV, down at the NAV every month. So you get um, thousands of dollars of gains each month. 
I show you all the time. This is not a video about Cornerstone. It's just demonstrating that, yes, this fund erodes. It has nav erosion, but you have to learn how to play it right. You time it around its rights offerings, and look at this special drip. Okay, these, these $4,000 lots that I have, around six forty nine. dollars you get an instant $400 extra each month. A couple of months ago, that was 30% of the premium. So you're getting thousands from each fund, okay, CLM and CRF. Um, and that was just extra money on top of the 21% dividend Cornerstone page. So yes, it erodes, but the play of the rights offering properly in Cornerstone. And when you buy my e-guide, we alert you of the Cornerstone rights offering announcement. When you buy my e-guide, you get free access to my phone number and discord okay the the chat room uh for life so here's the next thing nav erosion okay everyone thinks well the stock will go into the ground not every stock again some stocks are doing good for yield max like microsoft but let's just say theoretically tesla were to tesla were to go lower and lower and lower okay well tesla can just do a a reverse stock split and Everyone keeps saying, well, this is going to lower the dividend. But as you can see here on Investopedia.com, which is something that anyone can search for, it says here, um, future dividends would be adjusted to reflect the new lower number of shares outstanding. Uh, so it says here lower, the dividend payment is unchanged. All right. So I've, I've been through uh, reverse splits before, like in AMSA during Corona. Okay. It took the stock price down all the way down to around $2.00 which um, ruins its margin maintenance requirement. If, if a stock goes below a certain price, as you can see here, $5 a share for Cornerstone, then the maintenance can change. If your maintenance changes and you have a lot of money in it, then you can't live the fire lifestyle, okay? Maintenance, uh, again, which is in my volume three e-guide, my margin e-guide, as you can see here, available withdrawal is the key, okay? I have 210,000, so that means I can withstand a 30% correction overnight and I can still withdraw freely out of my brokerage account. I can use my E-Trade uh, debit and credit card to buy whatever I want in the world off of margin, which again is cheap interest, okay? It's low interest, so I don't mind using it and it doesn't show up on credit checks. So also, if we had a 30% correction, I have options here. I have short options on the stock market um, as a Marriott, that act as a Marriott hedge. I apologize if I'm moving fast, I'm on my phone. So these would absolutely clean up in a down market and a 30% crash in one night. So um, I I, I'm not worried about the, the, the margin debt. That'll just be paid back by my dividends in, in about a year. Uh, I'm not worried about a crash because I have short options on. And then as far as maintenance goes, if the stock prices fall below a certain price, then that maintenance can increase which can then lower this available withdrawal number, okay? So what happens at those times is oftentimes the fund can do a reverse split and then the stock price goes back up and then your available withdrawal goes back up because the price went above $5 a share, like in Cornerstone's case or in AMS's case, it went up above $2, so the maintenance changed and, and I was able to avoid a margin call by doing that. As you saw by that uh, definition on Investopedia, the dividend does not change, okay? And, you know, you can go, I, I've linked this in the comment section below in the, in the last video, but, I mean, you can check this out yourself. The dividends are, are, are unaffected. Uh, it's, it's artificial, as you see, as it says right here. Both are entirely artificial moves, uh, a reverse split or a regular split. Um, so I don't, I don't understand why people think this is going to go to zero. Uh, I haven't uh, interviewed Jay, but I've heard people say he would do a reverse split. I also emailed uh, Yieldmax once, and they said that reverse splits are possibilities. So if they do the reverse split, then you just keep collecting the dividends. So I would think that that's, you know, and all we care about are dividends here at this channel, okay? The dividends will make you outperform the market, especially when you're using leverage. And if you tie everything to the indexes, like many of the yield max stocks are, they're in the index, or uh, these defiance funds that we have, like JepWire, QQQY, or Cornerstone, which also tracks the indexes, okay, CLM, CRF. Okay, when you tie your investments to that, you're going to do as well, if not better than the index, because this has a drip. Cornerstone has a special drip program. But also, the, the leverage that I use, you know, I'm going to do better. And then if the market falls again, I told you I have put options on and and uh, my dividends will pay back the margin. So 
uh, this is how you continue to live financially free out of your brokerage account. Okay, uh, I think that'll do it for the video. Again, if you need help doing what I'm doing, email me for my e-guides at akintop48 at gmail.com, and I'll talk to you soon. Thanks.